Good morning everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Puzzle Quest as Saneko. This is part 19 and we just got beaten horribly by the, the boss Dugog and I have no idea how to beat the boss so let's just wander around, try to get some gold and some XP and see what happens. Get quests? No, they're not quests obviously. I was wondering what the hell. I can try to siege that. Let's tr give it a try. So this is a small tower, wooden gate, so this seems like a relatively low level place. Well, relatively speaking of course. Uh, so maybe we're going to win, and maybe we are not. Things can happen. Uh, let's just do the most obvious one and deal some damage. Okay, so this one again doesn't actually do that much. Um, okay, I completely missed that I have schools and schools. Uh, that is mighty embarrassing. Uh, what else can I do? So I can already start fireballing. So let's let's see what what this what my opponent actually has. That's probably like the best way to approach this. So this is small tower plus two damage whenever I do two more more. That's annoying. So I should get some blue mana to activate the troll ring. And I, I really need to upgrade it. I upgrade my blue mana so I can do it with three and, and not four moves. Uh, Battle wall plus hundred to life points. So this already happened. 75% chance of protect against one damage. So this is 75% and uh, yeah. Uh, which is basically more life and plus four damage whenever there are eight or more red gems in play. This is really dangerous. This is like three plus eight damage a lot. Uh, I'm mostly trying to match the red gems, but like I can't always do that. So oh, it gives my best. I think it's now active. It might still work. I don't know. Oh come on! That's so unfair. Okay, so this siege might probably not is very likely to not work. Uh, what can we do? Come on, that is just so unfair. Okay, so he's still out for life, and I uh, I could just steal his red mana, I guess. Uh, let's do this, <laughs> and then this happens. Okay. Uh, I should probably focus more on activating the troll ring. I keep forgetting about that because I got the troll ring like just like two episodes ago. And other, before that, I didn't need, like blue mana for anything, so I keep like disregarding blue mana when I just like look at what's on the board. Uh, I could start throwing balls at him. I could hit sink him once because there's nothing like super good with the map right now. Okay, so. I want full red mana so I can start bolting him. I could bolt him for like 50 or 60 damage before I run out of it. Uh, I still see no. Okay, okay, this one is useful. So before every bolt, I should. Wow, I'm almost dead anyway, so. Uh, let's take a look at it. I don't see anything super amazing, so let's keep bolting. 10 damage per bolt, I mean, it's a lot of bolts before anything happens, so. I could do this, and this seems safe. Wow, it's not safe at all. Okay, uh, one more charge and I'm dead. So I'm probably going to lose this horribly. And yeah, this is this is really annoying. So I, I just matched it twice and I only had seven. Uh, so I still need to get two more blue matches to get anywhere. At least I'm doing like decent damage, so this is something. But yeah, then I get this random lucky thing. Okay, this was pretty horrible. Let's give it another try. If it still doesn't work, I'm just going to do something else. Okay, so we can st we can go first. Um, let's just wait a second. Um, let's obviously start with the far off, and this is the good kind of mana. Uh, now we can get some red mana, or we can get a double match here. I'm quite. Oh come on! That was nonsense. Okay, now the troll ring is active, so this is at least something, and I don't think we're going to lose uh, blue mana at all in this game. It doesn't have anything that loses our mana, so uh, if we just prolong the game, uh, we're going to win this siege. Probably. It's always probably, like, you never know for sure if you're going to win or not. But I'm, like, much more advantaged to, to win this 
since uh, I gain life and he doesn't gain life. Uh, so I would like to fireball, but I don't have mana for that. There's enough red schools right now that is like the entire board is super dangerous. Or we could just like match some random red schools until uh, uh, it gets safer. Okay, uh, that seems less likely to cascade. Uh, let's bolt this. <laughs> okay, uh, well, he can always get lucky a few times. Like now and now and again. Wow. Yes, yeah, so I'm taking loads of damage, like like really, really loads of damage, and there's no like there's no better troll ring. I mean, okay, there is better troll ring in that uh, the troll ring itself is the same, but if I upgrade my blue mana in any way, it makes the troll ring better. I mean, presumably if I get like really, really crazy amounts of blue mana, uh, then I would be able to start with troll ring active, which would be crazy. Uh, I'm just going to hit swing him. If I keep him off red mana, he's not going to charge me, and that's nice. Uh, I'm not actually sure what happens when I when I win the siege. I don't think I siege anything the first time I played, but that was like years and years ago. Okay, I forgot to keep him off the mana, so. I'm at 40 life, but I keep gaining life, so this is not that as bad as uh, just the previous time. Yeah, so 43. Like, the life gain is re really fast. Uh, sadly, the, whenever I press next turn, I don't get more life, but it's probably for the better, because the, that also affects the boss. He would get like 20 life every time he gets like 20 uh, free turns. It seems to be all always. Uh, yeah, I just don't have enough red to just start bolting him. I could do that. Just random burn. Uh, what else could I do? Oh, oh, all oh, that could happen. Okay, so I'm probably going to lose it now. I worked a lot to get the uh, blue mana up so I can troll ring, and that was my way to win this, and now I have nothing. He has nothing as well, but he doesn't need mana, he has enough uh, other things. Okay, so what can I do that's not going to give him like a 5 school? This seems this seems to be safer. Okay, that was safe. Err, uh, ish. Come on! That was just so unfair. Uh. Okay, so I changed my mind from I'm going to win this to I'm going to lose this. Uh, it, and it was really fast. Yeah, mana drains, mana drains are one of the ways you can lose something that seemed really easy. But it, like, because I'm a wizard, mana drains always screw me. Like, it almost never screws the opponent, it always screws me. So I'm a wizard and I have a uh, troll ring I depend on, so these are two things I need a lot of mana for. This is a really mana intense class, so... Uh, there's no blue, there's, no, there's nothing basically other than some gold that I don't care about all that much. Oh, come on. Come on! And the free turn? That's just nonsense. Your hero is near death. Yeah, that's so much for, for my great plans. Uh, so, sadly, this entire siege is going to fail because of uh, mana drain. And even if... Even if uh, he got mana drain and not me, then that still doesn't mean. Really, oh, he, I mean, like, the the city or, like, the camp or whatever it is. It's a nomad camp, it's not a city, really. Uh, uh, I guess uh, there's some amount of uh, gold, I, uh, some amount of gold and XP I get from every battle if I lose it, but it's not all that much. Um. Okay, that's something. Yeah, so my best chance if... Uh, yeah, so he can charge me to death, like now. Doesn't even have to do anything else. 
So... That's the hitsing? What? Why did it end? Oh yeah, hitsing ends. I'm just getting confused now. The other one doesn't. Uh, yeah, this is pretty horrible since he can just charge me. And if I do that, that's probably not going to... Yeah, that, that actually broke the ones on the top, so that's saved me for a short while. But he can still charge me for 5 damage. Plus whatever it is. So, so he can literally press this button and win this game. This was this mana reserves by 5. Okay. I'm going to... Pre oh, I cannot press it again because I don't have... Uh, yeah, the mana drain pretty much killed me. Uh, so I'll have to try again or do something else. Let's hope for the best, maybe. Yeah, I need to mana drain him again and I can't. Uh, if he gets one more yellow mana, which is going to happen like right away, uh, then I lose the game. And there's so much yellow mana I can't prevent this in a meaningful way. So I could get uh, some green mana, but yeah, it's just not going to happen. I think I lost this one. Okay, so he didn't take the yellow mana for the win, even though that was super easy for him to win this way. Uh, what can I do? I could just shoot a fireball somewhere. Well. Okay, so that that was close, but I still lost horribly. Uh, let's maybe repeat one of the side quests. So I'm going to try it again. Okay, let's try to capture the wolf. Oh, it, it's still not captured. This is only the third time I fight the wolf. Oh no, it's not. Okay. So let's give it a try. And I might lose this anyway. So what do we do here? So the blue ones are going to be left and right. This is up, up, up. So we can do an easy one and just up, 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 up. Can we do it like a stupid... Okay, let's do a stupid way first. This is a stupid way. Okay, now let's... Uh, yeah. Ah, the stupid way worked. You are victorious. Okay, uh... Well... Let's get some side quests and let's repeat the side quests a bit. I definitely at least one more level. Uh, get quests. Harp infestation. Did it disappear? I think I think the side quest locations just disappear. Battle the harpies. Yeah, let's give it a try. I need another level, and after I get another level, I'm just going to try sieging again. What does a harpy can do? All schools in play are destroyed, and but that doesn't do damage, so this is actually good for me because I mana based damage, not school based damage. Reduces yellow mana in half. It's relatively fine. Uh, and this is just the same level as me, so it's not too bad. And this is reduces your enemy red and yellow mana by one. Uh, that's annoying, but it's not too bad. So far, so good. <sighs> oh. I missed the four off. Yeah, I, I've, I've, I like needed like some yellow mana, and I like uh, decided to do that before those fell. So I missed the four off. It was uh, a silly mistake, of course. Uh, it's sometimes it's kind of tilting when you just uh, fight somebody like ridiculous unfair, or just lose in an unfair way, like I did in the last quite a few, quite a few games. Okay, so this activates trollings forever, so now I have an active troll ring. Which makes it less likely I'm going to lose before the mana drain. Unless of course my opponent gets really fucking lucky like this before just like now. Uh, so what do we need? We need red mana to actually kill uh, the harpy. Uh, obviously not this. Yeah, so right now I'm r I'm at an advantage. Oh, that happens. Okay, so produce your yellow mana. Uh, let's just hit sing her. Oh, I... God, I just like look at one place and I don't look at another place. Yes. Uh, I'm just making excuses for myself and I'm like, all those excuses are fake. I'm just like, I obviously suck at this game. That's, that's the only, only reason. So she gets a lot of mana and I don't want her to have mana and I want this mana instead. 
Well, that might happen, and my trolling is now deactivated, and she's at full life, literally full life. Wow! At least I have, like, a really good starting position. Okay. How is she at full life anyway? Did I do zero damage to her? Well, maybe I didn't. Um, which way do we go? Do we have any follow-ups? I uh, don't think so. Uh, so yeah, so let's do one of them. Does it matter? That'll get one extra school. Okay. Okay, she got some decent amount of damage. Come on, don't steal my wild cards. They're mine. They are so mine. That's a nice double match. An extra turn for free. Okay, we get another of friend. Oh, maybe I should get the blue instead so I can activate the following faster. Uh, just yellow mana, so it doesn't really matter that much. Okay, so I have no chance of getting any blue. So the trolling is going to be inactive for a long time. I could get some red. Okay, let's try to do this. Well, all this happens. And uh, okay, she. None of this even matters. Like the charm doesn't matter. Swoop matters only mightly. So, I'm not going to care about that right now. Uh, so I still need uh, blue mana for a troll ring, yellow mana to start bolting. Yeah, it's always like that. Uh, why do you want that? No, I don't. There are too many schools, so if she actually would do that, that would be really nice. Since I would rather there to be fewer schools on the board. Uh... Yeah, I want that, but I cannot actually do that. Whichever way I go is going to just help her, not me. Uh, this one as well. This is safest. Okay, that was just lucky. Uh, I'm not going to complain about that. Some minor mana loss, that's not a big deal. Uh, I could do one bolt. Sure, 8 points of damage, it's always nice. And... Uh, Okay, let's do this. And let's do this. Wow! That's brutal. Oh, this is always brutal. One thing I'm most annoyed is, is with the troll ring. I felt like because the, when troll ring is working, it's working so well. It's really amazing. Uh, but when it's not working, like when it when it try to just when it just work to get the mana up, and then you get like the mana drained, or somebody steals your mana with like a war with a disease. It's really discouraging. Uh, I'm just going to hit sink her, I guess. Or I could try to get a trolling going. I mean, it's still very, like... This is going to be a long fight, probably. Since... Uh, she can uh, still... Uh, she can remove the schools from, from the board, and she steals my mana, so... It's going to be a long and slow fight. Uh, let's steal some manas. I can't use the manas anyway, but I can just do that. Okay, so I have one kind of mana in full-ish. No, not entirely full. Uh, let's hit sinker anyway. Okay, uh, still nothing to do. I could mana burn her. Sure. Mm. Okay, then no more skulls, so yeah, basically I need to bolt her, so I need yellow mana to bolt. Let's get some yellow mana. This is one bolt. Uh, it's a good time to bolt, I guess. Or I could start charging the troll ring. Let's do that as well. Oh, come on! That was just insanely unfair. Like, seriously, it was insane level of unfairness. Like, I, I'm just so disappointed right now. <laughs> uh, okay, so... Uh, still nothing. At least she's not gaining any life, so... It's eventually going to end. One way or the other. What do I even get for this, for this side quest? I don't remember.
Okay, so troll ring is active. Uh, that was a mistake, of course. But the troll ring is active, so it's not a big deal, unless it's mana drains again. The mana drains don't happen all that often. I don't know why they keep happening so much in the last couple of episodes, because before they were not really all that common. Uh, what am I doing? Uh, hitting sounds good. And still need red mana, but I can't get it. Oh, I can get red mana here. Okay. Uh, well, not because that's gonna happen. So that. Okay. Okay, so there's a pretty decent chance that... Like, without, an without another uh, mana drain... There's probably some, some way to use mana drain strategically, but... Uh, I mean, if I, if you have a spells that do something to the board, maybe you increase the chance of mana drains happening on your terms, instead of just, like, uh, being randomly screwed by them. Um, it's not much damage, but it's some damage. And if mana drain happens, at least I get some damage done. Uh, okay, and that's all of my damage so far. Yeah, so she had a 4 off and she ignored it and she got the four random random one anyway. Uh, the blue is the one I don't need right now because I have it maxed, but still, I, that's some kind of a denial. Or I could get a double match here. Come on, this is ridiculous and unfair. Uh, it's kind of sad that like this 4 of multiplayer doesn't work with schools, because 4, four times schools that would be so much fun. Uh, let's do this. Oh, come on! 16 damage for free, that was just ridiculous. It's just, I just get lucky a lot more than I do. Like, I'm more than 50% convinced that A is cheating. Like, seriously, like, the... I don't have I have not done any math, but it just looks much more common than any statistics would just there's no fair way that it's gonna happen like that. Like AI must know what's going to fall from, from the top. I like the way you usually implement those games is that you kinda simulate it a bunch of times, so uh you just have generate the list of all possible moves. And that's a free one. And well that's a free one but it didn't actually do anything, so it's kinda shit. So, uh, so you you generate a list of possible moves and then pick a best best one or one of the best ones. So the thing is that if AI knows what's going to fall from the top, it can choose like the move that's going to uh, much more often than, than in any fair way. So I suspect this is something that might be happening. Like I'm not certain, like I've not done any statistics, so maybe it's just uh, like an illusion. But it just really, really looks suspicious. Uh, yeah, I had that max, so I ignored that, obviously. Uh, I could have matched that, but if it's maxed, what's the point? Uh, by the way, like, why nobody ever like made a movie based on Better World? There's a dating game based on Better World, so like, you can make a movie based on Better World with Sandra Bullock, obviously. Every movie should like feature somebody like Sandra Bullock, Leonardo DiCaprio, or some one of the other awesome actors. I should make a list of awesome actors and talk about that. Uh, Sandra Bullock and Leonardo DiCaprio are definitely on the list. I uh, have not decided who else. Okay, uh, maybe I'll consider this and just just make a stupid uh, video about like uh, my favorite actors of all times. Uh, I already I already did, uh, mentioned two of them, but there is probably more. Most actors are shit. Let's face it. Uh, okay, second bolt three times. Uh, yeah, sure, let's do it. That's a decent amount of damage. So anyway, imagine like a Bejeweled movie where with Leonardo DiCaprio, who's not going to win an Oscar for it, obviously. Uh, that's never gonna happen. And Sandra Bullock, uh, and they're playing Bejeweled, and uh, I don't even know how to continue this. But I would watch it. Uh, Okay, so I just lost my manas. That is not gold. I can actually use other manas for that. Let's do this. I never actually used this, and I probably won't because uh, the loss of um, the loss of blue mana is just too big normally. 
Well, unless I get that, then it's just fine. Yeah, but like, but what movie like, like, it sounds silly, but is it? I guess if if you have to ask if something is silly, it's probably silly. Uh, the people just make movies about the same things over and over. But imagine if like you try to just make movies about something. Like you can't. Obviously, you cannot make movie about Sudoku, for example. That would be just crazy. But but what is something you may make like a movie over? Like if you can make a dating game out of something, you probably can make a movie out of something. And it really sounds silly, but. Come on, don't be- yeah, be nice. Okay, so I- no, I have one bolt. I have just one bolt and that's not enough. Uh, the sound that I've just heard is a cat just showing random things around. Just to get some more attention, because that's what cats do. Okay, so imagine a movie where you have like Leonardo DiCaprio and, and Sandra Bullock and obviously they're going to be shipped out by the end of the movie and Bejeweled and a cat. Uh, I'm just trying to add random things together, basically, like, you have a storyboard and you just, like, throw darts at it and just randomly generate, like, movie ideas. Uh, basically the way they make Family Guy. Level up, okay. Uh, Fire Master, obviously. How much would I need for... Uh, that just increases the max. I probably have, like, four levels of Water Master to get anywhere. Okay, so what I actually needed this level for... It's super important. Uh... Maybe I should train the wolf? Anyway, later. Uh, where, where am I even? What's the, what does it do? All enemies can start. You have built a magic, you can learn spell from this captive. That sounds nice. Uh, okay, yes. So what I want? I want flaming schools, but I need to disable something. So what, what do we use the least? We definitely need... Uh, so we definitely need a firebolt and uh, fireball and we need flaming schools. I use the hissing quite a lot of the other ones. I use mana bands relatively often, so we have space for one more spell. I never use this one. I'm never going to use this one. What? Blind an enemy for two turns? I do don't even know what it does. So the question is, do you want tons of power or do you want haste? Uh, think... I'm thinking the power of them sucks, so... Well, doesn't even matter. Okay, so I have a slightly higher level. Oh, this is a new quest here, of some kind. Maybe we should go there. Okay, so the quest was probably unlocked by level 15. Uh, anyway, uh, let's end the episode now, and in the next episode I'm just going to give it another try to siege this place, and if it fails, I'm just going to get the quest. Okay, so thanks for watching, and see you next time. Bye-bye.